They were deeply disturbing allegations when the National first reported them in September. An Ontario woman says her father committed brutal murders and buried the bodies on what was then her family's farm. Now, police are digging. Paul Hunter first brought us that report. He joins us now from Washington. Paul, what do we know? Peter, as a direct result of our investigation into this story, police in Ontario today began digging at a barn northeast of Toronto, looking for the remains of three Aboriginal boys who may have been murdered on that farm in the 1950s. The tale told to us by Ontario's Glenna Mae Breckenridge was that her father, now deceased, killed the boys in front of her when she was a child and buried them on the farm. This is the where boy. he made you watch this the is, burial? Yes and told me if I ever said anything, I wouldn't live to tell the tale. Breckenridge believes they were farmhands. They've never been identified and no one was ever reported missing. She told CBC that after suffering abuse and threats at the hands of her father, she effectively blacked out the deaths for years. When she told police about it decades later, they looked but could find nothing. This summer, CBC, with new technology known as ground-penetrating radar, found signals precisely where Glenna May told us we'd find bodies that something may indeed be buried under an old pig pen in that barn. Three shapes roughly the size of three teenage boys. Police later told CBC our report would be examined and if they thought it worthy, they would reignite the investigation and tonight it seems they have. There is no word on how long this process will take, just that after all these years, Peter, it's on again. All right, Paul, thank you. Paul Hunter, and he's back at his home base in Washington tonight.